Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into one of the most mysterious events in modern history, the Tunguska event of 1908. Picture this, a remote Siberian forest, the early morning hours, and a blinding flash, followed by an explosion that flattens trees for hundreds of square miles. What caused this cataclysmic event? Was it a meteor, a comet, or something else entirely? Let's uncover five mind-blowing facts about this incredible phenomenon and explore the scientific theories that attempt to explain it. Our story begins on June 30, 1908, just after 7 a.m. local time, near the Podkamenaya Tunguska River in Siberia, Russia. Imagine, if you will, the stillness of a Siberian morning, the rising sun painting the sky with hues of orange and gold. Suddenly a fiery streak blazes across the sky, brighter than the sun itself. Witnesses described a blinding light, a searing heat, and a shockwave that knocked people off their feet hundreds of miles away. This, my friends, was no ordinary event. The explosion, estimated to have been thousands of times more powerful than the atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima, flattened over 800 square miles of forest, an area roughly the size of a small country like Luxembourg. Trees, some towering over a hundred feet, were instantly toppled like matchsticks, radiating outward from a central point. What could possibly unleash such raw, unimaginable power? That's the question that has perplexed scientists and fueled speculation for over a century. Here's where the mystery deepens. Despite the sheer scale of the event, the Tunguska event left behind a curious absence, a crater. You'd expect an impact of this magnitude to excavate a massive crater, leaving an unmistakable scar on the Earth's surface. Yet expeditions to the site found no such crater. This absence of an impact crater has fueled some of the most intriguing theories about the Tunguska event. The lack of a crater, combined with the unusual pattern of the flattened trees, suggests that the explosion might have occurred in the air rather than on impact. This airburst scenario has led scientists to consider a variety of possibilities, each more fascinating than the last. Was it a meteor that exploded before hitting the ground, or perhaps a fragment of a comet composed largely of ice and dust which vaporized upon entering the atmosphere? The most widely accepted theory is that the Tunguska event was caused by a large meteoroid entering the Earth's atmosphere at tremendous speed. Friction with the air would have generated intense heat, causing the meteoroid to explode in a fiery airburst. This explains the lack of a crater and the widespread pattern of destruction. Another theory suggests the event was caused by a fragment of a comet. Comets are composed largely of ice and dust. A cometary fragment would rapidly heat up and vaporize, releasing a tremendous amount of energy. Some scientists propose the Tunguska event was caused by a collision with antimatter. When matter and antimatter collide, they annihilate each other, releasing a tremendous amount of energy. To grasp the sheer power of the Tunguska event, let's compare it to something we unfortunately know all too well, nuclear weapons. The energy released by the Tunguska explosion is estimated to have been about 10 to 15 megatons of TNT, which is thousands of times more powerful than the atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima during World War II. To put that into perspective, if a similar event were to occur over a major city today, the devastation would be unimaginable. Buildings would be leveled, forests ignited, and the shockwave would cause widespread damage for hundreds of miles. It's a sobering reminder of the immense power of nature and the forces at play in our universe. Now, imagine a Tunguska-like event happening today. The impact on our interconnected world would be profound. Besides the immediate devastation, we'd face widespread communication outages, disruptions to transportation systems, and potentially global climate change due to the massive amount of dust and debris ejected into the atmosphere. While events of this magnitude are thought to be extremely rare, the Tunguska event serves as a stark reminder that our planet is not immune to cosmic threats. It underscores the importance of continued research and monitoring of near-Earth objects, those celestial wanderers that might one day cross paths with our planet. Thanks for watching. If you found this video fascinating, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more intriguing content. The Tunguska event, with all its mystery and wonder, reminds us of the vastness of the universe and the countless secrets it holds. The universe is a vast and mysterious place full of wonders that we're only beginning to understand. 
Events like the Tunguska event remind us of the power and unpredictability of the cosmos, but they also ignite our curiosity and drive us to explore the unknown. Stay curious, keep exploring, and we'll see you next time.